Hello everybody, today we are going to be talking about how a cathode ray tube works. A cathode ray tube is something that you can see on old televisions or old com computer monitors. Short for CRT. CRT stands for cathode ray tube. This is a cathode ray tube. That's the electron gun. These are the conversion rings. The white stuff you are seeing on this screen off of an old cathode ray tube is actually phosphor particles. It's a powder that glows when it's hit by electrons by the electron gun because the electron shoots a x-ray which is called the cathode ray onto the phosphor screen and it glows. And this came out of an old projection TV. You could see it says, you could see the numbers are blue on there, but it says, if you look on the back, I don't know if you could see it too well, but it says X ray warning. And picture tubes are operating above the X radiation, and then so on. And then here's the cathode ray. That's the electron gun. These are conversion rings right here, and here's the front. After the front, there's the anode button. This delivers high voltage into the cathode ray tube. And then this is what comes off of the back. This is what you're seeing. This is this right here. You can also look in the bottom, you can see there's three holes that shoot X radiation at the screen. It's made of phosphor. One's red, green, and blue. Or there are three of them. One red, one green, one blue. And it shoots and it makes the picture. Which is really cool. And this is all copper and stuff. But there it is. It's really cool. Because the backs of these televisions are... They just have so much... There's so much technology back then, so that's why they have all of that. And I'm going to show you what a cathode ray tube looks like when it's powered up. And this is what it looks like. There's the words on the cathode ray tube. And you can see the green on the CRT right here. It's really cool when you think about it because those are just the green lights and this is actually fluorescent this shoots fluorescent lighting but it's really cool also these TVs are really strong they have very heavy duty glass on them and they're strong they're hard to break You could hear the sound of it, the glass, whenever I tap on it, you can hear how thick this glass is. It's about an inch thick, the glass. But there you go. Here's what they look like. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and learned something. If you did, share, like, and subscribe leave a comment and tell me what other things i should tell how it works and then you have